Johann Kajeldahl developed in 1883 a method for the quantitative determination of nitrogen contained in organic substances and inorganic substances, ammonia NH3 and ammonium NH4+. He named the sum of all measured nitrogen TKN, total Kajeldahl nitrogen. TKN plus nitrate nitrogen, NO3 minus, nitrite nitrogen, NO2 minus, and nitrogen gas, N2, can be summarized in the nitrogen cycle, which explains the conversion of nitrogen into multiple chemical forms as it circulates among atmosphere, terrestrial, and marine ecosystems. The conversion from ammonia to nitrite and nitrate is called nitrification and describes a two-step oxidization process facilitated by heterotropic bacteria. The conversion from nitrate, NO3- to nitrogen gas, N2, is called denitrification. Under the absence of oxygen, certain microorganisms are forced to extract oxygen from nitrate to convert it to nitrogen gas. TKN is a very important parameter for wastewater treatment. Although only ammonium is directly available for nitrification, TKN should still be measured in the influent to the wastewater treatment plant as well because it also considers organic nitrogen. Organic nitrogen can convert to ammonium nitrogen and must therefore be included in the calculation, otherwise an important contribution in ammonium loading to the biological reactor is missed out. The transformation from organic nitrogen to ammonium is called ammonification. When a plant or animal dies or an animal expels waste, the initial form of nitrogen gas is organic. Bacteria or fungi convert the organic nitrogen within the remains back into ammonium, NH4+. Therefore, it's important to account for organic nitrogen and ammonium in the influent of a wastewater treatment plant. Most permits in the US require to measure the ammonia, nitrate and nitrite, but not TKN in the effluent of wastewater treatment plants. Usual permit limits are less than 10 ppm for nitrate and nitrite, and less than 1 ppm for ammonia. Thanks for watching, and if you like our 3-minute tutorials, please subscribe and don't forget to give a thumbs up.